Hi and welcome to another video from the Market Outlook. In today's video, we'll be looking at the S&P 500 to gauge the overall health of the stock market and then we'll dive deep into the technical analysis of Snapchat and Palantir. Currently, we are looking at S&P 500 trading at all-time high of 4,271 and currently is grinding up much higher. So as per our previous video, we did mention that the price action will respect this white color trend line as you can see very well. And that's because in the previous two occasions, when price action did meet this trend line, you can see very good bullish price action forming further upwards after that. So the past two days, we have seen S&P 500 reaching this trend line. Price action has moved very high up as well as breaking through previous resistance. So if you look at the RSI, we can see that the reason for such good momentum is because RSI has held very well above the 50 level. And this shows that a lot of buyers are coming in to help the S&P 500 grind further upwards. And as per our previous video, we are currently still bullish on the S&P 500. And this gives us more confidence when we place long trades in stocks in the coming days. So that's for the S&P 500. Let's dive straight into the Snapchat. So Snapchat is trading at $67.59. We are at the day time frame. So what's very important about Snapchat is if you zoom in, you can see that price action has broken above this resistance zone. And you can see renewed momentum coming into Snapchat with this RSI bouncing higher. So to further break it down, let's look at the hourly time frame. So you can see very clearly for this resistance zone that just got broken in the previous historical price action you can see a lot of sellers coming in pushing price action further down and finally when it broke through you can see that there's a high probability that there will be no more sellers at this zone and we will look to have a good position in snapchat when prices re-enter this newly formed support zone retest it and we can expect a move higher so what's the price target for snapchat Basically, it's the previous high as you've seen the box I've drawn. It's about $73 to about $73.50. I think it would be a very good take profit target for us for our future Snapchat trades. Furthermore, if you look at the RSI, you can see the green line over here. A very good bullish increase in the price action, showing that buyers are coming in to help prices to grind higher. And thus, we are very bullish with this Snapchat. And thus, we are still very bullish with Snapchat and we will look for further trades when price action retests this zone. So Snapchat is very bullish. What about Palantir? If we look at Palantir at the four-day time frame, as per our previous video, we did mention that price action will reach a price of $28. So currently, it's trading at $26.47. So good thing about Palantir is that currently the 9 EMA, the yellow line you see over here, is currently holding Price, it's currently holding price action very well. You can see some choppy price action here, but technically prices for Palantir are grinding up higher and, and right now we are still bullish on Palantir. You can also see the RSI holding up very well above the 50 level and this shows buyers are still in Palantir grinding prices up higher as well. But there's still a risk that we must take note when we're doing technical analysis for Palantir is because there is an immediate resistance zone and if you do have some positions in Palantir, it would be good to take profit in this zone. As you can see that there's very strong selling pressure over in this resistance. So do take some profits when price action has reached here. Or if you want to be a bit more conservative, you can take some money off the table right now and let the rest continue to grind higher. So for now, we can look at Palantir and say that is bullish. But however, if you are in position with Palantir like me, where we did mention it, around $23. Right now we have about 15-20% profits you can take some off and let the rest run or let the rest run at break even. So currently that's the technical analysis I have for S&P 500, Snapchat and Palantir. So if you like this video, do remember to leave a like and subscribe to the channel as it helps us a lot and I'll see you in the next one.